Conversations with CaymanMama.com, and today we are speaking with Ryan Anderson, Director of North American Sales at Dupling Corporation, one of North America's largest supply chain management companies. Ryan, how are you today? I'm well, how are yourself? I'm good, thank you. Good. Ryan, can you tell us about Dupling Corporation and the services you provide? Sure. Uh, briefly, Dupling's been in business for about 26 years. We started in 1981 in the diskette and cassette duplication business. In the year 2000, we actually changed our name from Media Duplication to what is now Dupling Corporation. In regards to the services that we provide, we are an optical media manufacturer. By that, we manufacture CD-ROMs, DVDs, Blu-ray discs now, and we also provide a lot of uh, third-party logistics services, fulfillment, kitting, packaging, mail services, and so on. Uh, in regards to the size of Duplim, it, it varies throughout the year. Our busy season is the fall. Uh, we average probably about 350 employees. Um, in regards to total square footage, we are approximately 450,000 square feet between the two facilities here in Dallas and in Toronto, Canada. We cover anything from uh, software, hardware, uh, the religious marketplace, advertising agencies, direct end users, for example, people with indie bands or indie films that they might want to have produced. And so it, any city nationwide? We service pretty much every city nationwide. Uh, Dallas, Austin, Houston, um, Boston, Hollywood, Atlanta, it, pretty much everywhere. Fantastic. Well, in that case, your market is Duplium brings your vision to market. Can you tell us what you mean by that? Sure. That Duplium brings your vision to market has, has been our motto for, since the year 2000. And by that, we have a very close working relationship with our clients. And obviously, being in the industry, we see a lot of things that clients might not know about and you know, have different ideas. So we think of ourselves as more of a partner. Uh, you might have an idea of a product that you want to get to marketplace. We might have an idea how to improve it, maybe whether that be lowering your cost of delivering it to the end user, maybe improving the look a little bit. Um, so in regards to vision, it's you know, a lot of our clients come to us with a vision, with a dream, and you know, we like to think that we help them along the way to Material. get it out there, to materialize it, yeah. Can you tell us about Duplium Canada and what role they play in the overall Duplium solution? Is where this company originated, so they play Know, a large role in our overall business. Um, they service, still service some of our largest accounts. Um, we obviously distribute product across America and Canada. Um, it's much more cost effective for them to deliver to the East Coast than for us to deliver to the East Coast, but we handle the rest of the country. So geographically they play a, a large role, as well as you know they've developed long-term relationships there. So they have clients that they've been working with since you know, the early 90s, and those clients refer other people to us. And now that we have a true North American presence, they're allowed to you know, offer Canadian companies that they might be dealing with a North American solution to get their products to market. We've seen on your website um, that Duplium is able to print 360,000 discs per day. Can you elaborate on that and what that means for the general public? Sure. Um, Basically what it means is we have the manufacturing power to produce 368,000 discs a day. A lot of that is dependent on the size of the runs. For example, a thousand piece you know, run takes a certain amount of setup time compared to a hundred thousand piece run and so on. Uh, what it means to the marketplace though is it, it is extreme firepower in regards to the amount of discs that we can produce. So two things that we've always been good at, uh, especially good at is you know, quick turn replication as far as you know, clients have the need for um, they need 10,000 discs produced same day or next day we can service that as well as we have you know, a fantastic state-of-the-art printing technology that allows us to provide a superior look to what a lot of people can do with our offset printing technology that we're using. That leads me into my next question which <clears throat> you do have Cutting edge technology. Can you tell me about that technology and that how that sets you apart? Sure. One of the the things, that, and that's always been a little, it's always been great about Duplim is it, it's a, it's a it's a private company, but the the owners have always reinvested in the company. They've always made sure that we're on the leading edge of technology. And, and being a small sized, small to medium sized company on the optical side, um, that puts us you know at a disadvantage against the Sonys of the world. 
Um, yet, you know, the executive here have done a great job in reinvesting. Lately, it would be our Blu-ray technology, and we're now investing in Blu-ray technology to be able to provide that to our clients. USB duplication, the printing that I mentioned, uh, offset printing, is a newer technology that not everyone's using, but it gives you photo-like images on your disk. So their digital download is a service that we provide to our clients that a lot of people don't provide. So we're always trying to stay ahead of the curve in regards to technology. Very nice. Uh, does Dupleam also offer digital printing? Yes, we offer all sorts of paper printing. Digital printing would be one of the services that we provide in-house, complete with variable data. We do a, a lot of mailing, so we produce, we print and produce a lot of mailers, some that you know, hold a DVD or CD-ROM. We've, we've actually come out with a custom mailer that will mail at the letter rate compared to a flat rate. And if you don't know what that means, basically it cuts your postage in half by about 50%, which is a huge advantage to our clients. Absolutely. Absolutely. Ryan, can you simplify the difference? I, meant, I heard you mention replication. The difference between replication and duplication and how customers should decide which one's best for them? Sure. It's, it's, it's a funny question, and I'll, I'll get to that. The, the main difference is a replication, we have to create a glass master. There, there is a cost in creating that glass master. So for short run, you know, 100 pieces, 200 pieces, it would be best to duplicate because it'll keep your cost down. Um, for larger runs, 1,000 pieces, 500 pieces and above, it makes more sense to replicate. Um, the difference is replication is a superior product. It's, a, it's actually a manufactured product where the information is stamped into the disk as opposed to duplication where the information is burned onto a layer of dye. Um, most of our customers have uh, no idea what the difference is. I've, I've given tours to companies who I've replicated millions of disks for and then I, three years later they come in to see our facility and they, they always say, oh, I thought you would have, had, have a bunch of burning towers. That's not it. It's, it's a, replication is a true manufacturing process where duplication is a burning process like you can do at home except on a larger scale. Thanks for that clarification. Um, can people download brochures and file specifications from your website? Of course. We, we're working with a great web company um, and we try to make and provide as much information to our customers on the website including templates, account setup forms, specification sheets, they can download you know, Duplim demos of some of our different offerings. We try to make our site as customer friendly as possible. And what, uh, how do people find you on the web for more information? At www.duplim.com and that's D-U-P-L-I-U-M.com or they can call us at 1-800-928 2018. Well, Ryan, thank you very much for your time and exclusive interview with CaymanMama.com press release distribution. Uh, we wish you the best of luck. Thank you very much, Aaron. Thank you.